Maya Wilson is here, um, goal shooter for New Zealand. They've won this Nations Cup. Maya, congratulations. How do you feel? Oh, really ecstatic. I think we had to fight really hard to get that win, and Jamaica came out all guns blazing, which we knew they were. They're a confidence team, and they play with a lot of flair and just a big bird in the back who they love to vomit yeah, into. So I think they're at points where we're really very clinical, well. but um, then are they, a win's a win and we're really grateful to be going home with the trophy. You are the cream of netball, the World Cup um, winners. Um, do you feel that you've done your best or you could have done better than this? I think we're just grateful to win. Of course, there's always times that we can analyse our own game and be like, we can do this better, we can do that better. But I think for now, we've uh, built a really good foundation within our environment with everybody being on the same page, knowing our structures and being able to get on court and really play. So I'm really grateful that we're able to get so many players out on court and get some quality game time. OK, let's talk about the Jamaica defence. Did they give you a hard time? Yeah, of course, we always knew, I always knew that they were going to come out there. You know, Shamira Sterling, who has had an amazing time over in Australia in the Suncourt Super Netball, so, and so is KDN, actually, playing with Melbourne Vixen, so I knew it was going to be very physical, and then, of course, it did get physical. I'm just grateful that we were able to stand up and be able to still put those goals in the hoop with that physicality. Okay, we witnessed a bit of fight there with Shamira. Uh, what really happened, Shamira Sterling? Oh, I think it was basically just me trying to slow her down and she didn't like it, she was a bit tired so I think that sort of played into it and as that thing comes over and over again I assume that it frustrated her and that might have been what happened but I think for us we're just trying to stay ahead in the game I believe you've learnt a few things from this Nations Cup, what sort of things have you learnt and how will you use them when you get back to New Zealand? Yeah, I think I'm actually proud that I've been able to get out on court and get a full 60 minutes um, be a regular starter within this Nations Cup and for me that was quite foreign coming into it so I'm grateful that I've been able to build that confidence up for myself knowing that I'm able to play in this international netball and moments like today's game which were really tight uh, I'm just really glad that I'm able to step up when I needed to and that's something really cool to take back home to my uh, Northern Stars team. I believe you guys are going back to New Zealand soon how soon will you get back on the court? So we head home tomorrow afternoon and we have about a week off just to refresh the legs spend some really quality time with family and then back into it. I know uh, we start our yeah, domestic actually, season right. in March, so we go back into pre-season. Our teams are actually um, back home. They've been training, I, I know my team's been training for the last two weeks, so looking forward to seeing um, what they've been doing and the hard yards that they've been putting in. And we actually have a game against Melbourne Vixens and the Giants coming over from Suncorp in two weeks' time, so really looking forward to get out and playing against um, some quality opposition. You are a brilliant shooter and I believe you are an asset for New Zealand. Shall we expect to see you at the next World Cup in South Africa? That's definitely the goal. I would love to be picked. I guess my time has in this team has been a bit up and down. So knowing that my spot might well, not be solidified yet, that's still like four years' time, but definitely somewhere where I want to be. You have millions of followers and fans out there. Would you like to say anything to them before you go? Oh, I'm so grateful for all the love and support that I have received, as well as the whole silver fans that we have here. We're very grateful. We just we can hear you loud and clear, so please don't quiet now because we love it. Maya Wilson, goal shooter for New Zealand. Thank you so much for speaking to us and good luck. Thank you very much. Thank you.